Hallelujah, hallelujah. Glory be to Jesus. Shalom, the Lord bless you. My name is Roger and I welcome you to God's Move channel with Pastor Roger. In the name of our Lord Jesus Christ, amen. Hallelujah. Glory be to Jesus. If you're watching me for the first time, you're highly welcome. God bless you. Thank you for watching. Thank you for, thank you for tuning in. Just click on the button subscribe, like the videos and share it with your loved ones. And God who is the rewarder of men will bless you mightily and abundantly in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ. Amen and amen. Hallelujah. Glory be to Jesus. For my consistent subscribers, God bless you. Thank you for always being there. Thank you for your consistency. May the Almighty God increase you. May He cause His face to shine upon you in your going out and in your coming in. In the name of our Lord Jesus Christ. Amen and amen. Hallelujah. Glory be to Jesus. Praise Master Jesus. For this is the day the Lord has made that you and I will be glad and rejoice in Him. Praise Master Jesus. The prophetic word of today, the Lord says, I should tell you. Hmm. Someone you know is looking for you for these particular reasons. Someone you know, someone you know is looking for you for these particular reasons. Hallelujah. Praise Master Jesus. We live in we live in a time and seasons whereby we turn to avoid some certain people because of what we heard or because of what we saw that person doing. Hallelujah. For we're going to understand that time is a factor. If there's one thing that is not constant in this life is change. The fact that that person did what he or she did in the past doesn't mean that person will forever remain like that. Remember, before you became a child of God, before you became a successful person, you had you had a lot of shortcomings. You had a lot of downfalls. Before you became a child of God, you were living a sinful life. Remember the things you did, the horrible things you did in the past, and the people whom you did those things to. But when moment you gave your life to Christ, the Bible scripture says, For all things have passed away and everything has become new. They looked at you and when they looked at you, they studied you. They did not just judge you from what from the, the first time, the, 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 the second time, or the third time, or the fifth time they saw you. They did not just judge you. They said, Ah, this person says he is now, he or she is now a child of God. This person says he believes in Jesus. Let's watch, let's observe and see if this person's life, this character, his this person's character really portrayed Jesus. Christ. Hallelujah. Then they watch you now, they understand that, oh, this person has truly changed. But now there's someone, there's someone who's looking for you, someone you know, who is really looking for you and really want to talk with you for some particular reasons. Hallelujah. Number one of the reason is this. Now, God wants to use that person to bless you because you've been praying and asking, oh, Father, I need divine helpers. I need divine helpers to sustain me, to help me, to abide the vision you've given me so as to so as to help me fulfill the assignment or the purpose which you've called me in to do. Hallelujah. Now, the, the Bible, Jesus says, I should tell you, God is using this person to do what? To search for you. This person is searching for you to bless you because God has laid in this person's heart to bless you to bless you. Now this person has no peace, this person has no rest, this person is worried. And he's like, Oh, I need to see this person. I need to see this person. He can't really tell why or for what reason, but he just really wanna meet you because God has laid in his in that person's heart to do what? To be a blessing unto you, to be a blessing unto you. But now due to the, the person's past, due to the things that you know about this person in the past, you're trying to avoid it this person you're trying to walk away hallelujah you're trying to walk away the law says do not walk away do not walk away for the, you you're walking away is walking away out of your destiny is walking away out of your purpose is walking away out of the fulfillment of god promises over your life hallelujah praise master jesus number two thank you holy spirit i just hear this now the law says this person is looking for you right now to tell you the secret or the mysteries behind that pain you went through so as for, for, so as to help you come out so as to help you come out of it hallelujah praise master jesus something happened but you're unable to understand the mysteries that happened that were that that were behind the force that was behind with the incident the incident that happened now god is about to use this person as well to reveal that mysteries unto you but until you know the cause of a thing you will not be able to solve that thing until you know the cause of a sickness you will not be able to heal the sickness until you know the cause of a thing you won't be able to sustain that thing the law says this person is looking for you to reveal that mystery unto you for you to do what to come out of that limitation for you to come out 
of that bondage for you to come out of that setback wonder for you to come out of that spirit of stagnation for you to come out from that chain that yoke that enchantment that was made in your life and over you and over your family and i pray for you today in the name that is above every other name in the name of the lord jesus may the lord turn your your captivity may the lord turn the hearts of your of your enemies and may god bring whom he wants to bring into your life and may your heart be open to receive this person in the name of jesus i pray for god to give you a sober heart a sober spirit a sober heart a sober heart and a sober spirit to receive this person in oneness in unity and in love in the name of the lord jesus christ thank you father thank you holy spirit for in jesus mighty name Amen. I hope you receive this word with gladness. And as we hearken unto God's voice, may God do exceedingly and abundantly and above all things that man could think of in your life. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, you are blessed, you are favored, and you are lifted. For in Jesus' mighty name, amen. Stay blessed, and God bless you. Shalom.